All right, guys, today I am over in Belden Village in Canton, Ohio. I am going to Dick's Sporting Goods over here because I need a new pair of shoes. I'm not a big sneakerhead. This channel is not about shoes, but I love shoes. I love unique shoes, and I'm really in love with the new LeBron 17 Toon Squads. I really want to get a pair of those. But I also find myself in love with the purple ones. The purple ones with the yellow heel on them. They are so dope. And they would match the B. So we're going to go in here and see what we can find. Good, how are you doing? I actually almost ordered some Jordan 4s last night. Some red and black ones to match my hat. Because I wear this hat all the time. Alright guys, so here's what we got. These They don't have the Toon Squads, unfortunately. These are the ones that I am so in love with right now. Look at that yellow heel that is so dope. The purple swoosh, bright white, those are so awesome. I just don't know though. <laughs> I want the Toon Squads, I might have to order those too. However, I did notice these as I walked up here. Look at that. Jordan, why not? You gotta love Jordans. I don't buy Jordans very often because so many people wear them, but these are so cool looking. Although I gotta say, I like the plain white ones too. I love plain white shoes, but they get dirty so quick. Okay, wait a minute, let me look at these. See, here's the red and black ones, which would totally match my hat. <laughs> but, I, I don't know, they just... I'm just not in love with them. Now these look cool, but I'm just not into the high tops anymore. Hmm. I don't know what it is about like all the multicolor stuff that I just love so much. I don't know if I love these or hate them. Here's that same kind though in pure white. And I absolutely love the pure white, but they're just so impractical, man. Especially with me going to live in my RV, I'm camping 100% of the time, so white shoes are not going to work. Look at these Brooks running shoes. I've looked at these online a couple times. Those are kind of cool, but I don't see myself wearing those. I kind of like these. I like them both, but... I think these are the ones that really stick out to me. I love the orange, especially against that white. That's really cool. I used to wear shocks when I was in nursing. They were pretty comfortable. And I like the way these look. They're a little darker, so that would make more sense when I'm out on the road. Okay, I would not wear these, but it's definitely something that catches my eye. I love that. <laughs> But yeah, I wouldn't wear this. Here's some Adidas Ultra Boost. I used to love Adidas. In fact, I'm wearing 1990s Adidas uh, Bounce right now. I love those. They're my favorite Adidas ever, so I buy them on eBay all the time. But, I don't know, the newer stuff I just can't get into. Now, I actually have been looking at some of these online, but they're yellow, pure yellow. And I do love them, and I've... I actually have them in my cart, but I just haven't pulled the trigger yet. I don't like these gold ones, but the yellow are awesome. Air Max 270s. I mean, these look okay, but I don't love that giant heel. The word that comes to mind when I see that is Bobos. <laughs> okay, so as much as I love these, I'm going to pass on them. <laughs> okay, now I know I just said I don't like the high tops. <laughs> They're not all that high, and the thing that I'm really liking about these, or at least it's tr trying to sway my decision, the fact, besides the fact that I just love them anyway, um, they're 25% off, and it's 25% off the price in there. So these would be about 135 bucks, something like that. <sighs> hmm. The white version here is 199, but I actually, I do love these. But I like the black ones better if I'm looking at this style. I will say this. I love that King James on the back there. Look at that. That is cool. It's molded right into the shoe. 
Oh my god, look at the bottom. That is sweet. <laughs> I do love that multicolored look. All right, guys. Well, my mind is made up. I'm buying nothing. <laughs> Simply because they don't have a 12 in either of the ones I want, unfortunately. Man, I am so disappointed. That sucks. I mean, I can order them online, but I just wanted to pick some up today. It does bring me back here, though, to the shocks and these. And I don't, I just don't like either of these enough to get them, even with 25% off. I do like these shocks. But I just don't think I want them. Let's see what these are here. Just for the heck of it. Air Zoom Pegasus. Uh, no. Uh, Pegasus. Yeah. Still. Yeah. Uh, ugh, yeah, I don't want that. Dang, there's not even like a clearance section in here or anything. You know, just to get a, a cheap pair of kicks. These kind of caught my eye, though. Hmm pretty cool looking Timberlands. I don't think so though. I do need some kind of hikers because I'm going to be going to awesome places to hike in my RV. But yeah, I don't think I'll get those. What the heck? Look at these Merrells. <laughs> I don't think I could ever wear anything like that at all. Here's some more Tims here, but I'm not really digging any of them. Well, I guess that's it. I will, look at these Irish setters. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I will say this though. These guys are really clean in here. They're, uh, they're walking around like spraying and wiping off everything. Every individual pair of shoes. You know, because when you're shopping you're doing exactly what I'm doing. Picking up each individual pair of shoe, looking it over, you know, trying to decide if you actually want it. And these guys are... Uh, they're really keeping it clean in here, so props to Dick's Sporting Goods. I don't think they have any RV-related stuff in here, but let's check it out just in case. This is all outdoor stuff over here. This actually reminds me of when I explored the abandoned Dick's Sporting Goods at Garfield Heights. That was a sight. You guys got to go back and watch that video. They still have some of the signs up around the... Uh, the walls and that like I think they had a couple of big pictures there and stuff but man seeing this place packed with merchandise and then thinking about that where it was just empty and it was pitch black in there because it was the middle of the night it was so awesome you got to go back and check it out we got Yeti coolers here I'm not really sold on Yeti coolers though I mean I'm sure they're good but I mean I have that $20 cooler from the dollar store and it kept my stuff cold for four days straight 30 seconds on the clock. I'm playing basketball. <laughs> That's from Monster House, in case you don't know. They got all this fishing stuff, and I cannot imagine um, not fishing when I'm living in my RV, but I've just never been big into fishing. You know, it's one of those things where you have to just sit there and do nothing, basically, and wait for a bite. And that's not me. I am way too hyper to just sit there. Even like deer hunting and that, you know, I could, my dad liked me to go deer hunting with him. Look at this multicolored kayak here. That's pretty cool. Um, but, uh, yeah, my dad liked me to go deer hunting with him. And I just, I couldn't stand it. You sit there for 12, 15 hours in a deer stand waiting for a deer to walk by. And I just, uh, I could never get into it. I'm way too hyper. Right. Indians jerseys. Oh my God, guys, look. Big league chew sandals. Holy crap. I love them. Look at that. That is so hilarious. They got green and purple. <laughs> That's awesome. Wait, here's some clearance right here. Uh, first, we got to see if they got my size, and I don't see any. Nope. What's this here? Nope. I don't see my size in any of these. Not even in the dope Asics. <laughs> This is what I need to be buying for my chubby butt. <laughs> oh, check this out. We got inversion tables. Right now, I'll bet you anything this would feel so good. My lower back, I picked up some chairs the other day and it pinched. And it still hurts, hurts like heck in there. Look at that little lumbar thing. Pretty cool. I'm eventually going to get a bike to ride while I'm out there at the campgrounds and stuff. 
Um, these are pretty cool, but man, I'll tell you what. Look at the seat. My butt does not like that seat. A couple more up here, but I don't know. Nothing that catches my eye. Nishiki. All right, I highly doubt they're gonna have any over here, but they have famous footwear and DSW shoe warehouse around the corner here. So let's go over here, see if we can find anything in there. You never know. They might have something coolio. Okay, here's our men's shoes. You know, I'm actually glad that I see these right here because I almost bought these online last night. And seeing them in person, I just, I don't like them as much as I did on the internet. Look at these guys, Air Monarchs. These are such dad shoes. <laughs> I do not want these Pumas. <laughs> I don't know why it was important to tell you that, but heck no. Look at these Reeboks though. These are totally like 80s style, revisited. We didn't have any money when I was in school and I was in like seventh grade, I would have died for a pair of Reeboks like these. Oh look, they got Doc Martens. I actually used to wear these guys, believe it or not, with bouncing soles. Okay, these are pretty cool, but no. Clearance, you say. Clearance, you don't say. <laughs> breaking the law, breaking the law. Okay, here's some cool Timberlands. I could get into these. 100 bucks. I actually have something at home kind of like this, though, when I really don't need them. They're just cool. All right, I'm not digging anything I see in here. Let's take off, go next door to this other place. Famous footwear. BOGO, buy one, get one half off. Pretty cool. Here's some low Air Max. I, I don't know. I don't really like them, though. These look better online for some reason. I could go for the Air Max torch if they had them in yellow and black. Here's some yellow and black, but yucky. I hate that heel. Yellow and black Pumas, but not really digging those. I don't know, I kind of like them, but not really. I didn't expect them to have my LeBrons, but oh well, worth the shot. Okay, here's some clearance. Let's check these out. Anything cool? This. Eh, nah, those are 13s anyway. I've never seen Doc Martens like this before. I wouldn't wear them, but these red and black Pumas aren't too shabby, but I still don't like them enough to buy them. Ooh, now these white ones. Those aren't too bad. Hmm, but if I'm gonna get the all white ones, I think I wanna go for those uh, Jordans. And I just cannot get into this sock material that Adidas is doing with these right now. No thanks. These are kind of cool sandals. I like that design. Hmm. I'm not going to get them, but I like them. That was a bummer, but anyways, at least we got to see the cool ones over at Dick's, even though they didn't have the right size. So... We'll keep hunting. Maybe I'll just get online tonight and order what I want. It's fun to go shopping, though. It's fun to go into the stores and actually look around and touch the stuff, see it in person. Because like those Air Max, they look really cool online. I really like the way they look online, but in person, I just didn't like them at all. All right, guys, I'm back at Dick's for one more round. I've decided to buy the Jordans if they have my size. Here they are, guys. I've decided to get them. He's running back right now to get my size. I'm still totally bummed that they don't have the Lakers in 12s, but yeah, I just, I got in the car and gave myself permission. Yeah. Awesome, thank you. And here they are. Check it out. Oh my God, yes. So cool. All right, let's go buy these puppies. I went in there not wanting high tops or Jordans and I came out with high top Jordans. 